Eugene police say a man barged into a downtown office, harassed tenants, and dumped chemicals in the hall. Good evening, I'm Brian Richardson. And I'm Brandi Smith. Police, fire, and hazmat crews all responded and evacuated the building. KZI 9 News reporter Lauren Meichler is live at the scene with our top story at 6. Lauren. Brandy and Brian and witnesses say it all started when an employee who works inside this building tried to stop Matthew Madden from allegedly harassing a woman and trying to steal her purse out here on the street. That's when Madden allegedly chased the employee inside. I heard some loud voices. I heard um, a guy kind of making a big ruckus. It sounded like it was coming from downstairs. And, um, and then I got a call from from Rosemary at Ballheiser saying, you better, you better go lock your door. We have a crazy guy down here. And that's exactly what Sherry Conowitz did. And she says just in time. And as I'm trying to lock the door, I hear the guy down the hall walking towards our office. And I got it shut probably, I don't know, 10, 20 seconds before he got to our door. Conowitz said that aggravated the man and he started to scream. Open up this door, you know, open up the door. And when we wouldn't, that's when he started getting violent and kicking it. And he took a fire extinguisher and repeatedly hurled it at the door kicked, punched, you know, banged on it trying to get in. As Conowitz called 911, the suspect broke into one of the utility closets. He found a, a gallon of some chemical and was showing us, I have this, and he started sprinkling it outside of our office as though he was, you know, threatening that he was going to light us on fire. I'm not really sure what his intentions were, but he was in a very, um, aggressive, violent mindset, and he was definitely letting us know that he wasn't up to any good. Shortly after that, police arrived and arrested the man. At the time, they didn't know what the chemical was, so the three police officers who were exposed were taken to the hospital, and the building was evacuated. After a little more than an hour, hazmat crews determined the substance was just a mold and mildew cleaner. But even with the chemical spill in the clear, Conowitz and her fellow tenants say they're still pretty shaken up. Yeah, I'm worried. <laughs> um, I don't I don't really know what to do. Um, the downstairs, most of the doors are already locked. You know, we're a business open to the public. You can't keep your front doors locked. Conowitz says she's worked in this building for more than five years and they've never had an issue like this. Madden is charged with meth possession, disorderly conduct and criminal mischief. Live in Eugene, Laura Michael, KEZI 9 News.